second cinnamon roll. I got some coffee. And then I'm about to go do some Christmas shopping because I have zero gifts purchased for anyone. I'm gonna see my nephew, then I'm also gonna get more work done. Busy day, busy day. No working out today. It's gonna be an off day. I should have taken one yesterday. I don't always track like my off days. I don't take them every single week, even though maybe I should. I just take it when my body feels like I need to take an off day. So today, I feel like I need an off day. So I'm taking an off day. guys so this vlog is gonna be a little bit different even yet than the other ones I really want to kind of just give you guys a little bit more of a insight or background into kind of life before water drug fitness or even before you know college just so you guys can kind of see where you know I came from like I just showed you or I'm still just in the parking lot right now of my high school where my graduating class was 89 kids now I'm certain a lot of you guys have graduating classes three, four, five times more than that. I mean, that's a very small graduating class. Um, it wasn't that I graduated a long time ago. It was just, I'm from a small country town. I guess you wouldn't even, I mean, it's not that small, but comparably to like Cincinnati, it's very small. But in the area, it's, I mean, it's small, but it's not like teeny tiny. Um, there's just like bigger schools around here so I'm from Defiance Ohio and you can locate that on a map if you want to but it, you'll see that it's not a very big town there's and I keep saying town so like when I go uptown I'm literally going to the one place that has all the stores it has the little mall it has all the food you know shops um, you know, Burger King McDonald's Taco Bell all that good stuff it has a hospital um, those things but one of the things that was different for me when i first moved to cincinnati was i would say all right i'm going uptown and they were like what are you talking about you're going uptown i was like you know i'm going uptown they're like no that doesn't that doesn't fly here because there's so many you know there's cincinnati there's all these little suburbs that have their own little town i mean they have their own shopping malls they have their own places to eat like it, i just called it a town because that's what i was used to it was different for me. But, yeah, I mean, I came from a really small country town. It was nice to grow up in a small town, don't get me wrong. Um, there are things that I was sheltered from that bigger schools or bigger locations, you know, had trouble with. Obviously, eventually, I had to be shown those types of things, you know, that just weren't in our small little subset of a town that, you know, think like, you know, drugs weren't an issue here, high school fights weren't an issue here, drinking wasn't an issue here in my high school, whereas now, you know, kids that's in high school and stuff, that's all a lot of people do. Not everyone, I'm not saying you all do that, but I'm just saying it's, it's more common now than what it was. And even where I'm from, it wasn't even a thing. You know, my buddies and I would go to like my one friend's house and we'd hang out in their basement, we'd play video games like Call of Duty, Gears of War. No, I wasn't like a nerd. I was still kind of jockey, but um, I was, I was kind of cool. I was cool. Um, we'd play ping pong. So if there's any ping pong players out there, I will. I will school some people in ping pong. I will school people in ping pong. I'm good. I'm not even gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say that I'm mediocre. I am good at ping pong. Um, I played golf in high school. I played like basketball some years, but not much in, I only played like one year in high school, one or two. I can't remember, maybe just one. Um, I played like a year or two of baseball in high school. Um, I don't know. I mean, high school was fun. Lifting was not a thing I ever did or ever wanted to do in high school. It just wasn't exciting to me at all. It didn't appeal to me. I didn't play a sport where I needed to lift and be strong. So, I don't know. I just didn't. Yeah, that's really all I wanted to say about my high school and where I came from. It was a small town, like I said, but it was an enjoyable time. Um, I like coming back here, but there are things that, you know, I don't care for about a small town. Is like, I can't. There aren't a lot of places where I can go lift. 
one. That's, that's a big issue. Can lift. Um, and I do still like to try to lift when I come home for um, any time, like whether it's the holiday season or just come home for a few days. Like I always try to lift still. Um, so keep an eye out for like a video. My lips are really chapped. Keep an eye out for a video of like a home workout because I'm going to do one of those, but not in this vlog. And um, I also even still while I'm home, I try to eat healthy most of the time. Do I let myself, you know, go a little bit? Yeah, sure, because I'm at home, like my mom makes food, I want to eat her food, because I don't ever get to eat it. Um, so things like that, like I don't, I'm not super strict on myself like I am when I'm just, you know, doing my own thing. When I come home, I, I let loose a little bit. I think it's pretty cool. My stepdad makes these like wooden cutouts of you know like Christmas stuff, mostly just for family. We got this one down here, and then we got Santa. So I don't know. It's pretty cool. Pretty hands-on. About to have some dinner. I have some green beans, some like beef rice some tri-tip, it's like a steak I think, deviled egg. I'm gonna have several plates. Whoops, I need to turn something up. So obviously this isn't a prepped meal, it's not my prepped food. It's a little off of my normal diet, but again, as I said, you know, home for the holidays, I'm going to loosen up a little bit, go off my plan just a little bit. It's, what, Christmas day right now, so then tomorrow, which will be Monday, I'm gonna get back to my prepping. I actually had to get the plan around for the uh, cutting plan, the new cutting plan that's coming. So, you know, if you guys wonder, do I always eat healthy? I gotta turn that down a little bit. Around, um, like the holidays, for the most part I do, but there is again time where I let myself have some of the more flavorful things in life, or you know, my, my mom's home cooking or my parents home cooking. I eat that stuff. Like desserts, I've definitely had some. There's a big old tray of dessert out there that I plan on eating as well. So I'll just get back to the gym though. I'll get back to prepping. It's a minor setback, but it's, you know, you gotta enjoy those little things every once in a while to keep sane. At least that's my mentality. Um, and you know, do I work out still? Yes, I still work out over the holidays for the most part. I haven't, I didn't yesterday and I didn't today but that's just two days off. My body needed rest anyways, so then I'm gonna get back to it tomorrow. So if you guys you know, have those little setbacks or you know, cheat over the holidays, just know that you're, you're gonna have to work a little bit harder, but you know, I only do it for a little bit of time and, and then I get back on it. I don't make it like, oh, because it's Christmas and then New Year's, I'm just gonna continue to eat bad this whole entire next week. Like, no, that's that's not my mentality. That's, you can, I guess, if you want to, but I wouldn't recommend it. I mean, I just, I can stop myself from, from going overboard. So, like I said, it's in moderation. I had some good food. I'm going to eat this today. I'm going to eat some good food tonight. And then tomorrow, I'm going to get back to it. All right, so one more thing before I end this video. I actually had a rough time today getting into the gym. I didn't actually go to the gym. I did a home workout, which I'll put that video up soon. But yeah, I didn't make it into the gym. I woke up late. I didn't eat right again. And it got me to thinking like, because I'm so far off of my routine and I've been off of my routine, I haven't been eating the way that I've normally been eating. It is easy, or it was easy, I guess I should say, for me to skip the gym and not even really, you know, be like oh I skipped the gym because I honestly because I think you know I wasn't eating the way that I normally eat when I work out I wasn't waking up at the times that I normally wake up when it's time to work out so when I got so far off of that routine a workout just really didn't even I didn't even really want to do it because I was like I'm just at one point I think I had like one meal through you know half the day I just didn't really want to eat so 
I actually I had to sit back and this isn't supposed to be motivational by any means but I had to sit back and I was like I had to think about what I was thinking about when I was being lazy if that makes any sense so like when I was being lazy I had to think about why was I being lazy so I think that's something honestly that I do really well which helps me is that when I'm being lazy or when I'm being unproductive or when I'm not doing what I should be doing I think about why aren't I doing this why am I procrastinating is it just because you know I'm being lazy and I just need to do it is it because I don't want to do it is it you know what is it and then I can fix why I'm not doing it see if you can think about what you're thinking about while you're being lazy it will help you to like reflect and be like okay I'm just being lazy because X or Y or whatever and then you can fix it um, along those lines I'm eating another <laughs> cheese snack this is my last cheese snack and then I'm prepping tomorrow so it's my last cheese snack and I'm actually gonna prep but I got some peanut butter crunch because peanut butter crunch is delicious but again I haven't gotten peanut butter crunch in probably I don't even know months probably like a year but I was home and I'm off my routine so I went and I bought peanut butter crunch luckily that's all I bought but um, again I just did a workout I feel really good I feel much better um, so I think like I said I'll be able to get back on track tomorrow I plan on doing another home workout I plan on doing some home workouts while I'm here at home that was a repetitive but while I'm here at home so that I can get those videos out to you guys so whether it's you guys can't make it to the gym you're traveling you just want to do home workouts whatever the case is I'm gonna try to get some stuff out like that for you guys just to give you more ideas or if you need a quick pump before you go out whatever the case is and one last thing I hope you guys have a great and safe holiday season and that's all I have so please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this thanks for watching I hope you guys enjoyed